within the lines of endless debates, about who Uganda's greatest football of all time is, no old-timer of Ugandan football can assemble a list of the greatest football players in the Pearl of Africa, without mentioning the name, Majid Muzizi. The debate revolves around other numerous names, of which Philip Omendi comes out as the highlight of them all. Others have cut the long debate short, by, drawing a conclusion, placing Majid Muzizi as Uganda's greatest goal scorer, and then Philip Omendi as the overall greatest Ugandan football player to have lived. Of course, not all shall go by that conclusion, and that is the true essence of football debates. Majid Muzizi cut his teeth during his teenage years, in a little-known football team, Milago FC. He then moved to Pepsi and later to SC, Villa in the Uganda Top Football League division. In 1991, his skills led SC Villa to its first ever CAF Champions League final. The following year, he made history by becoming the first Ugandan to sign a contract for professional football in Europe, with French second division club Stade de Rennes at $180,000, scoring for them 28 goals in 51 matches between 1992 and 1994. He led Stade Rennes, into Ligue 1 in 1993 and won the Best Foreign Player Award in France ahead of established stars like Abedi Pell and George Wee. He was then traded to Turkish club Ursuspor in 1994, where he scored 31 goals in 77 matches. It was here that he played his greatest football, making him one of the greatest players in the Turkish league, where he won accolades for Player of the Month and Foreign Player of the Year. There, he also founded the now famous Ursuspor Crocodile Walk goal celebration. Every time he found the back of the net, Muzizi would crawl on his knees with the hands on the ground, followed by delighted teammates in momentous scenes that lifted the entire stadium and those following on television. Today, the Timsu Arena, the home of Bursaspor Football Club in Turkey was built in a design of the club's nickname Green Crocodiles and this is a key icon in keeping the memories of the legend closer to the club faithfuls. In 1998, he was traded to Dardanelspa, another Turkish club, at a record Ugandan fee of 1.8 billion Ugandan shillings. Then to DA Nan in Vietnam from where, Muzizi returned home to Uganda and joined Garba United, as he considered going into retirement from active football. On December 13, 2005, Majid Muzizi died at Nsambia Hospital. At 38 years of age his football club career in summary, started at Milago, through Pepsi, Sports Club Villa, Stade Rennes in France, Bursaspor, Dardanelspor in Turkey, Dianan in Vietnam and finally Ugandan side, Garba United. Won two Sikafa titles with the Cranes 1989 and 1990. Won six league titles, three Uganda Cups and one, Sikafa title with Sports Club Villa won the league Golden Boot four times 1987, 1989, 1990 and 1992. In 1991, he scored 17 league goals to become the first player to reach 100 goals in the Ugandan league. Won the Sikafa Golden Boot twice 1987 and 1990. Won two Sikafa titles with the Cranes 1989 and 1990 scored hat tricks for the Ugandan Cranes on three occasions 1987 versus Zambia, 1991 against Tanzania and 1998 against Rwanda twice voted Footballer of the Year 1987 and 1990. Just mentioned but a few. Besides being the first Ugandan to play professional football in Europe, the name Majid Muzizi means so much more than just that to Ugandan football branding him as one of the country's greatest football players of all time.